Okay, in this video, I'm going to be talking to you guys about the Hilton Honors Card. Now, American Express actually have three different Hilton cards, but in this video, I'm going to be talking about the Hilton Honors Card that has no annual fee. But hey, if you're new to the channel, my name is Dwayne with How to Build Credit TV, and on this channel, I talk about everything you need to know about credit, credit cards, and how to make money using credit cards. So be sure to subscribe to the channel and click that notification bell so you don't miss a thing. Okay, so when it comes to credit cards, American Express for me is like up there and maybe even number one. And so in this video, I decided to talk to you guys about the Hilton, Hilton Honors Card, uh, more specifically the Hilton, Hilton Honors Credit Card that does not have an annual fee. And the reason why I'm doing the video on that particular card is because that card has an incredible sign up offer going on right now. So if you're if you've ever been interested in getting a hotel credit card, this would be the one to start with for the simple fact that there's no annual fee and once again, they have an incredible sign up offer and we will talk about that in just one second. So when it comes to credit cards, like I said, American Express has a wide variety of cards from which to choose. And so the Hilton Honors Card is no different. They actually have three different Hilton Honors Card that you can choose from. And I think the first two, um, as far as like the one that has no annual fee and then the one that does have an annual fee of $95, I think it is. Uh, let me double check here. Yeah, 95 bucks. Um, and then the, of course there's another one that is more but the first two right now if you use my referral link which is below this video in the description you can click on that link and you'll be able to get this particular sign up offer and it's a way to help the channel out and I certainly appreciate your help so if you're interested in getting a Hilton Honors card from American Express be sure to use the referral link below in the video uh, or in the description section alright so I'm gonna jump onto the website I'm actually already on the site but I'm gonna share my screen with you guys so that you guys can see it. So as you can see, you, you're you gonna click on the link and it's going to bring you to this website right here, uh, which is an American Express website. And of course, right now, right now at the making of this video, this is one of the best offers. This is the best offer that I've ever seen in regards to the Hilton Honors Card. Uh, when I was making, thinking about making the video, I didn't know what the sign up offer was at the time. I was just so excited about the Hilton Honors Card and I wanted to share that with you guys. So right now, if you sign up with the referral link in the description section, you can see here for the Hilton Honors Card, this card here on the left, you can earn $100 statement credit after your first purchase on the Hilton Honors Card within your first three months. Now, that's really, really cool. You get a $100 statement credit, uh, which is like, that was not the offer when I signed up. When I signed up, I only got, um, I think it was 80,000 points after spending $1,000. So right now, you'll get 100,000 Hilton Honors bonus points after you spend $1,000 within the first three months. And this should be pretty easy to spend uh, in three months, $1,000 depending on how you kind of time your application or purchases that you have coming up, I think it's reasonable. Uh, and just to kind of mention real quickly here, you have the Hilton Honors American Express Surpass card. This one is a solid card as well. And as you guys can see, you get $150 statement credit uh, after you make your first purchase. It doesn't specify what the purchase has to be. Maybe I'll do some digging in this video to kind of double check but you get 150,000 bonus points after spending $2,000. Um, there is an annual fee of 95 bucks. So let me scroll down and see if I can find uh, information about just exactly what's going on as far as the $100 statement credit, okay? So I just want to read this just because I wanna make sure that this is legit. So right here, um, you know, I clicked on it and it says, of course, you have the 100,000 points. Uh, and then you have the $100 statement credit. To qualify for the $100 statement credit, you must make an eligible purchase with your Hilton Honors American Express card within your first three months uh, of card membership starting from the date of your account is approved. The statement credit will be applied eight to 12 weeks after your first eligible purchase. Eligible purchases to meet your first purchase requirement of this uh, offer include those made by both the basic and additional card members uh, so it's pretty straightforward. It looks like literally there is no requirement, okay? It's just that you have to make a purchase, uh, and that's it. It says um, right here in this paragraph, it says you can earn this welcome offer 
uh, starting from the date your, your account is approved. In rare circumstances, your period to make your first uh, purchase and spend 1000 may be shorter than three months, blah, 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 blah. But for the most part, this is pretty freaking straightforward. Um, it looks like if your application is not received by April 21st, 2021, we will not process your application even if uh, we later receive your application. So this is pretty cool. I, I wanted to just kind of click on that and kind of see if the purchases had to be specific to maybe Hilton Properties. It didn't state that. It just states making your first purchase. So that is really cool. Uh, just to kind of give you guys an idea, 100,000 bonus points as far as the Hilton Hotel, the, the Hilton, Hilton brand hotel, uh, it can go pretty far. If you guys are um, curious to try to stay at maybe in uh, Hampton Inn, um, Homewood Suites, uh, Embassy Suites, you're able to get uh, quite a bit uh, for your points. For example, you can redeem maybe 15,000 points, 18,000 points, for a standard room and uh, Hilton, uh, not Hilton, uh, Embassy Suites, Homewood Suites, and Hampton Inn. I think all of those are suite types of hotel. So the standard room will be a suite, which basically means you're going to have a sofa. You may have a, a full size refrigerator with a little kitchen area that you can cook. So it's pretty cool. Like it's a full on suite and 15,000 points you're going to be able to get if you if you milk it and spend between 15 to 18,000 points in order to get that one night for the, those hotels that I mentioned, you're going to be able to get at least 5 stays, which is pretty sweet for spending $1,000 that maybe you're going to spend anyway, right? So, um I really wanted to take the time to really talk about that. I'm going to click on view card details and once again, this is just for the basic Hilton Honors card. Um so as you guys can see here, the APR is between 15.75% to 24.74%. I can't read, 15.74. <laughs> um, and so it tells you right here, you can earn seven times points on Hilton purchases. That is pretty cool, that's a lot of points. You can earn five times points on groceries and dining. That is really dope. And it, it includes, uh, of course, you know, at the grocery store and uh, US restaurants, right? Uh, and then you can also earn five times points on gas. This is actually kind of new to me. I don't know because uh, I have this card. I don't know that I've paid any attention to this uh, in the past. And I don't think that this was um, how much you could get as far as points are concerned. And then you can earn three times points on all other purchases. Uh, you get complimentary Hilton Honor silver status, which is really, really cool. Um, it, it says uh, Hilton Honor status with your card. Uh, plus 20,000 on eligible purchases on your card in each calendar year uh, can earn an upgrade to Hilton Honors Gold status through the end of the calendar, the next calendar year. Um, so that's pretty cool. Of course, there are different things here that you guys can look at uh, in regards to travel. Uh, of course, there's no foreign transaction fee. That is really, really good. There's actually uh, car rental loss and damage insurance, which is really awesome as well. Of course, there's the helpline. Then there is shopping and entertainment, just to kind of click on that and see, because I am curious. Um, okay, it doesn't really say anything in particular about that. And then additional services. Okay, of course, there's fraud protection, and then you can pay, pay it, plan it, uh, which is pretty straightforward there. Um, one of the cool things that I do like about the American Express cards is pretty soon after submitting your application, and if you're approved, you're going to be able to uh, get a number that you can use, a credit card number. It's gonna be temporary until you get your physical credit card, but you can use to make online purchases. And I think that's really cool, just in case you're in a position where you can meet the minimum spend. You can actually start spending on the card before you get it. But this card is super duper hot. This is my second hotel credit card. The first card that I got was a Marriott Bonvoy card. Uh, from American Express, and then I got the Hilton Honors, just the regular Hilton Honors, there's no annual fee. Um, and that is pretty freaking sweet. So I wanted to, like I say, take the time to talk about this particular card. If you guys are in the market, if you have never gotten a hotel card, this is a pretty solid one to get. Once again, there's no annual fee, and the sign up offer of 100,000 points is freaking incredible. You see it right here on the screen. It says earn $100 statement credit after your first purchase on the Hilton Honors card within the first three months. That's freaking dope. And then in addition to that, you get 100,000 points, which is insanely valuable. So as far as I'm concerned, you have at least 
six seven hundred dollars worth of worth of value from this particular sign up offer even if they didn't have the one hundred dollar statement credit you're still going to have six seven eight nine hundred dollars worth of value as far as the one hundred thousand points are concerned when it comes to redeeming those points at hilton property so that's pretty much it for this video be sure to give the video a thumbs up it helps the channel tremendously we do live streams here on this channel normally on mondays at 7 p.m central so if you have any questions feel free to come to the live stream and interact and have your questions answered live. Once again, my name is Dwayne with How to Build Credit TV and I approve this video. I'll see you in the next video. Until next time, take care and be blessed. Peace. Peace.